Good day viewers, you are welcome to today's math class. Now, solving for the value of s from this nice logarithm equation, how do you go about this? Firstly, step 1, take the log of both sides. So we are going to have log x raised to the power of log 2x is equal to log 5. Now, from the logarithmic property, we can recall that when you have log a raised to the power of n, we have n log a. E, right so bringing this power down here we are going to have log 2x multiplied by this dot means multiplication log x is equals to log 5 now let's expand this expanding this we can write we can record that log a multiplied by b is equals to log a plus log b so recalling this logarithm property let's write this as log 2 multiplied by x right multiplied by log x is equals to log 5. now using the property we will write this as log 2 plus log x all into brackets multiplied by log x is equals to log 5. Now, don't forget log 2, we can write it as log 10 divided by 5. 10 divided by 5 is 2, right? So we have plus log x multiplied by log x is equals to log 5. Now, recall the property of log redeem again. When you have log a divided by b, this is equals to log a minus log b. Now, let's now, using the property we record the other time, you can now write this as log 10 minus log 5 plus log x, all into bracket, multiplied by log x is equals to log 5. Now, don't forget log 10 with the base of 10 is equals to 1, right? So, we know that the value of this is 1. Now, multiplying all through by log s, in order to open this bracket, so we have 1 multiplied by log s, we have log x. Here, we are going to have minus log 5 multiplied by log x, and here we are going to have log s squared. So, bringing this to the left hand side, we have minus log 5, all equals to zero now let's factor out log s is common here when you factor it out we are going to have log x into bracket log s minus log 5 and we are left with log s minus log 5 right so let's put that at the side plus log s minus log 5 all equals to zero since we have common terms when you factor this out we are going to have log s minus log 5 into bracket multiplied by log x plus one here yeah, right it equals to zero now this implies that log s minus log 5 is equal to zero and also log x plus one is equal to zero now let's now solve to find for the value of x starting from the case one where we have log s minus log 5 is equal to zero collecting like times we have log x equals log 5 now recalling this logarithm property when you have log a with the base b is equal to c this is equal to a a equals to b raised to the power of c that is changes this log reading equation to an initial equation so in this form now let's do that here don't forget log in its natural base is in base 10 therefore we can just write this as s is equal to 10 raised to the power of log 5 which is our final answer and at the other side collecting like things we have log x is equal to minus 1 doing the same Thing here also, we are going to have 10 raised to the power of negative 1, which is 1 over 10. So, this 
this is our two values for x, which is 10 raised to the power log 5 and also 1 over 10. Guys, please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to my channel. Thank you.